Hello again, it's just me, MJS Man, another unboxing video for you, this time. The new Nintendo 3DS XL. Now, obviously, as big as the old uh, 3DS XL in screen size, but this is the new 3DS XL, which apparently has different features. You might wonder why it's a bit brighter than normal. I've got a lamp, so that when I record things like this, I get extra light. Yay! Uh, so, without further ado, let me unbox my new 3DS. Okay, so here we go. Uh, please excuse the, the shadow, it's the snowball mic. Uh, can't really help that. It's. Um, there to record my voice, obviously. Now I want to open this as careful as possible because I like to keep my boxes kind of intact and not ripped, if you know what I mean. So if oh, <laughs> there we go. It wasn't being very nice. Sorry about all the rustling by the mic. That's the Kind of the downfall of having the mic right next to where I'm unboxing things. Right. And so... Oh, 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 there's the actual unit itself. Oh, uh, remarkable. And I think that's it. Now, with the new 3DS, it, it even says on the bottom of the box there, if you can read it. Um, there we go with the focusing. Focus, focus. Focus. <laughs> anyway, it says AC adapter is not included. See back for details. So uh, the, the back kind of I'll show you the back of that. Uh, <laughs> the actual details there are at the top. If you can see there, it says this system requires an AC adapter, which is sold separately. Blah 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 blah. Um, adapters provided with the Nintendo 3DS, 2DS, DSi or DSi XL systems are compatible. So basically, if you've got an existing uh, charger, you don't need one, basically, pretty much. Uh, because I just happened to have over there the power supply. Now this one was, f was for my old 3DS. And... It's the same. So, really, if you've already got a 3DS, uh, well, if you've traded it in, oh dear. <laughs> uh, but if you've kept the charger, then, um, then good. Okay, right. Now, this set includes the new Nintendo 3DS XL system, European version, a new Nintendo 3DS XL stylus, a 4 gigabyte micro SDHC memory card. Now that's a good start. They actually give you a, uh, a memory card. Uh, AR cards, the um, augmented reality cards, uh, the operations manual, quick start guide. Uh, this, the system comes with the stylus and micro SDHC memory card already inserted. So if we uh, just pop the box oh, just there. Uh, right, as you can probably see there, well, if it's not too bright, so I apologise if it is, because uh, I wanted to get plenty of lights uh, on this. So there are the AR cards, which, they're pretty much the same as what you had with um, the old 3DS, basically. Uh, so, <laughs> they give, they've given you some more. Uh, customer support, that's obviously if you have any problems and whatnot. Um, the new quick start guide, which is pretty handy just to get you set up and uh, whatever. Now it says, if you own another 3DS system and want to transfer data to your new system, transfer your data before playing. After configuring install the initial settings for this system, owners of a system in the Nintendo 3DS family should perform a system transfer before play. Apparently, it's not as easy 
as the diagram shows there, it's kind of just showing me from one deal to the one. But apparently, it's actually quite a bit more complicated than that. Charge and turn on the system. Uh, oh, please attach the front plate before using the system. Oh. Well, I don't have any plates because I don't really care. <laughs> Simple as that, really. Uh, there's a configure system st uh, start software connect to the internet, which obviously I won't be doing any of that just yet. Uh, and all that's left in there is the operations manual. That's the full, the full jizz. If you pardon my expression, I should stop using that expression there. And now, for the moment itself, the unveiling of the new. Nintendo 3DS XL Metallic Blue Wow, it's actually quite a dark blue. It's not as light as you may see um, online on websites and stuff. It's actually quite a dark blue. Rather nice. Ooh, pretty. Uh, underneath it's covered in my fingerprints already. <laughs> Actually, other my fingerprints because the box was covered in fingerprints. I've, mind you, I, I've been mauling it slightly since uh, it arrived. Uh, just about an hour ago or so, maybe less. The, uh, the size of the screen, oh my god, that is just immense. Uh, let's take the protector away there. And there we go. Oh, there you can see the cam. Oh, hang on, hang on. Forget the reflection right. There's the camera. It's sitting on top of my PS4. <laughs> uh, but yeah, there we go. There is the 3DS XL, the new one. Uh, you can see it's... Oh, no. Why top if I actually point it towards the camera? It's quite slim. Yeah, it's not uh, too, too bad. Uh, underneath... There is the stylus. It's a pretty basic one, really. It's just plastic. You know, it's nothing special like how with the old 3DS um, XL you had the big, like, pen style um, uh, Games go in. Oh, focus, focus, come on. Oh, what the hell? Stupid camera. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there we go. There is where the game goes in. If you can see that, it's sort of... But as you look at it, it's the bottom left. Uh, then you've got headphone port in the middle there. You probably know all this if you've seen all the details and whatever. Uh, the actual on button is now on the front, rather than before when it was inside. All you've got inside now is the start to select buttons, the usual A, B, X, Y buttons, and the C stick. That's the new one. Um, obviously you've got the uh, the, the old uh, analog pad there, and the, the D pad. And there you go, you've still got the, uh, the slider there for the 3D. Uh, camera, oops, the camera in the top there, which, oops, Sorry about the shine there, let's try and get it back the camera up the top middle. Uh, speakers on each side. And yes, it's uh, very nice indeed. Um, not exactly sure how you're supposed to get the, the plates off, as in a, to be able to swap them. Oh, you've got um, the volume. Oh, come on. Camera focus. <laughs> You've got uh, the volume uh, just on the side there. Actually, that used to be sort of on the actual unit, so now it's on the other side. You've got your 3D adjuster on that side, and now you've got the volume switch on that side. Um, under, oh, at the back there. Uh, let's try and get that nice and close without unfocusing or defocusing, whichever. 
And you can see you've got the L2 buttons. Uh, L2 and R2 buttons. So you've got that uh, extra shoulder button there. You've got the one which is sort of on the edge there. And then you've got, well actually if I turn it this way, but <laughs> you've got two shoulder buttons there and then an extra two shoulder button. So, hmm, there's a, an infrared port just there. Um, obviously that's where the power goes and that's, you've probably seen those docks and obviously you would just slot it in and the, the power thing would go in the middle there. So, there you go. Um, they even still include somewhere to put a wrist strap. So if you want to carry it around on your wrist, you can. <laughs> um, but I think that's pretty much it. Without actually turning the system on, which I don't want to do yet, because obviously this is just an unboxing. I want to get it all set up and everything ready and connected to the internet. I guess I could power it on if it's got a bit of power in. Oh, you've actually got a mic uh, at the, the bottom there. Uh, will it turn on? Has it got enough power? Give me power! No. Oh well, there's no power. It needs charging. So, uh, so there's a bit of a warning to you if uh, anybody um, who hasn't ordered one yet, when you order one, you will need to charge it up. <laughs> because it's. you got no power! But, uh, yeah, there we go. That's. Oh, sorry about the shine again. Uh, that is the metallic blue um, 3DS. Well, the new 3DS XL. It's, n to be honest with you, it's not as spectacular as it may have seemed like online. When you see um, the different pictures of it online, it's really not like that spectacular. Although, if I uh, just wipe, wipe away my fingerprints, <laughs> if you can see that, the, oh yeah, you can just see it says new Nintendo 3DS XL there. And as I say, apologies for the flash there, but it does help you to see that lettering better because it's pretty dark. It's a, it's a kind of pretty dark grey on a dark blue background. So, um, but yeah. Um, now, as far as I know, if I remember correctly, the uh, the memory card, the the SDHC card, is actually inside. Um, if I can, uh, well, there's a couple of little screws there, which I'm guessing you would unscrew to to remove the plate. So, bear with me just a second while I get a little screwdriver, okay? I have managed to find a little screwdriver, or like one of the, what you call it, a jeweler's screwdriver. So, let's undo the screws. Now, this shouldn't <laughs> void my warranty. Uh, if it does, I'm sorry Nintendo, I've completely screwed up. So, apparently... Well, I've undone those, and you put, you kind of use it like a, a, a crowbar, but for some reason, the screws down appear to be actually coming out. I mean, they're only little screws, so they're not exactly going, going to... Uh, take a lot of unscrewing. I can feel that it's loose. Oh, there we go. If you unscrew by lifting up at the same time, then that's it. Okay. Let's move that over there. So if we lift that off, put that there, there's nothing inside there. It's just... And there... Oh, Sorry, I'll keep going up here and thinking the camera's up there. Uh, and there is the inside of the 3DS. Uh, 
obviously the batteries there well because of being able to take the back off you should be able to replace that battery no problem if needed and in there is uh, the micro SDHC card as you can probably see there it literally just clicks in and away you go simple as that really and so that is what you basically need to do if you want to change that micro SD card for something bigger obviously if you wanted to put in a 16 <laughs> excuse me, a 16 gigabyte card in there this is what you need to do is literally take the back off and put the card in there so uh, there you go <laughs> That's the uh, the back taken off. There we go. Nice and simple. And so uh, yeah, that is the new Nintendo 3DS XL. So sorry for any blurriness in there. The camera's always the same. I should really probably get a better one or a newer one. Um, I hope you've enjoyed that. I hope it was uh, informative. Um, especially with a bit taking the back off there um, because you need to take that off to be able to put on the new style plates um, which you can usually buy I think they're around mm, between 10 12 quid some sites are selling them for like 15 quid or something like that so have a look around you should be able to find them for around 10.99 seems to be the average price um, but other than that uh, I shall thank you for watching uh, if you've enjoyed that if there are any questions uh, you can always contact me on Twitter uh, rather than do it through YouTube here if you want to contact me on Twitter instead uh, that would be better um, because it's more instant and so uh, yeah I'll thank you for watching if you've enjoyed the video please leave a like and if you'd like to see more uh, unboxings in the future of any new tech or any games that I may have, then please subscribe. But for now, I shall say, bye!